Okay guys, so welcome back to another Scrappin' Irish video. And this video is going to be slightly different as in I'm not really going to do much in this video. It's more I need a little bit of help or advice. Um, so what is the video about? Well the video is about these filters. So these are filters that I would have used when I was filtering out my gold foils and uh, stuff like that. So um, I want to know what way would you process these? What's the best way that you found um, any guys that have been doing these? I would usually, my method of choice would usually be put these into a jar with um, acreage in it and it will dissolve any of the gold foils usually. But when you have a lot of foils and only a lot of uh, a lot of these and only small little flakes left on them, stuff like that, um, it mightn't be the most economical way of doing it. So, um, what I plan on doing maybe, and I want to see if you agree with it, is, well, hold that there for me and we'll go to a different spot rather than in here. Um, where I can actually show you a bit better what I'm talking about and what my plan is. And then you can let me know in the comments whether you think that will work better than just putting these straight into the Acarija. And um, if you think it's going to be a no-go or you think it's better doing it the other way. So what we'll do is we'll go and um, use the magic of editing and we'll go to another spot and we can have a look at what, how much actual um, filter paper I have to do. I also want to put gloves on because some of the filter papers will still have bits of acid left in them. Um, bits of copper um, from when I was using it. There will be some copper as you can see from some of these. You can see the green on them. If you can see the green, I don't know, can you see the green? That will be copper um, that is still in, in it. Some of them are very, and I'm gonna wash my hands now in a minute but some of them are very green and stuff like that, but you can still see like gold foils on them. So I want to know what would be the best way. So um, as I said, I'd usually just drop that maybe into Acarija and let the Acarija dissolve the gold. But if, too, if, you, if what I'm finding, if you have too many of them and only small amounts of gold, is it worth doing it? I'm planning on do maybe doing something different. So let's talk and let's go to the next spot and have a look and see what you think will this work or won't this work for me and um as always uh, no wrong answers always just it might be a bit of advice or whatever and i might just because i mightn't go with the way you tell me to go and i go some other way don't be offended every as i say every way everyone has their own way of doing it and there's no wrong way or right way there's some ways might cost more some ways cost less some are quicker some are slower some get more gold some get less gold and at the end of the day, it comes down to what you want to do. And again, I'm no expert. I'm learning as I'm going. And I'm just showing you guys what I do and what way it turns out. So don't be getting mad at me and saying, oh, you should have done it this way. You should have done it that way. At the end of the day, everyone does their own thing on their own channel. So let's go. Let's talk more action. Right. So here we are in location two. And... Um, I'm just sticking on the gloves guys because as I said some of these filters still have acid even though it's dried I still don't want it on my hands or because you might touch your face and dry and next thing it's wet in your mouth or tail whatever don't want it near me so give you a closer look at what I'm talking about here so as you can see these are filters that I would have used to filter before and I have gold foils and some of them will come still I might be able to brush some of these off and some of them are kind of grained into it and stuff like that. So we have like gold foils in them. So that's the, them filters. But I also have these filters. So these are filters that I would have taken from when I done um, Nacarija, I would say. And I um, diluted it, or, or filtered them through here. And some of this may be fine gold powder. It may be silver powder. It may be just copper. It may be other bits and pieces. But this, will contain some gold and because the, the acarija was filtered through and no matter how well you wash it out there's always going to be trace gold i think left in them so this is what these are all from so i've dried them out and i've left them there for a while as you can see some of them are dried out more than others some of them are gone very brittle from being dried out and stuff like that so 
As I said, I usually put this into Acarasia and then I would um, redo it again. But every time you do that, you're left with a little bit more. You might, you know, the foils and stuff like that. It's a lot of, a lot of liquid to, to get into all these foils. So, or all these filters. So my plan, what I'm thinking of doing, and this is where you guys come in, is you can advise me if they think this will work or won't work. So we'll have our bucket. We'll have something like this, which I can just throw the these into. Plan on burning this. The bits will, that are burnt will go down. Eventually we'll get it all down here when we keep burning all these foils. We'll get them down into the bottom of this. So in that will be whatever hasn't burned away. So there should be foils. There should be the, um, again, as they, when you burn the thing, there will be the carbon papers or whatever left. You're going to be left with a certain amount of stuff that won't burn away. And I'm hoping that we'll be left with gold bearing material. Then my plan is to take that material and put that into the Acarija. And hopefully then at the end of that, we, when we do our Acarija, we will have a um, gold don't know how much because again there's only these are only things i have a good bit like of these i have that tub over here i have another tub here and i have another tub of them so they're built up over the last two years or so um so that that's what i plan on doing burning them and then adding that to acarija so will i have any issue i have to watch out for guys will it work will this be just absolutely not do not do it no matter what you've done this and it was a complete failure and everything went wrong or it worked perfect for you you've done this before this is the way you deal with them or do you advise i just keep putting them into the acarija and eventually bit by bit but i use up a lot of liquid is my problem that this will use a lot of acarija because as the this dissolves into the acarija it will um clog up on it it doesn't like it just goes gloopy in it stuff like that and will i end up with a bigger mess so i think in burning them is the way to go um that i burn these foils or burn these these um filters and then afterwards i should be left what should be left in the bucket should just go into acarija then dissolve that down then filter that out and then drop the gold from it hopefully i'm not saying there's gonna be an awful amount in it but there is a little bit of gold or do i just um throw all this into my buckets of um, waste material I have already and hope that that, they, um, that will dissolve because there's aqua region there. Obviously there's, there's the nitric acid and the, the, um, the hydrochloric acid in them and then big buckets put in there and see will that work. Either way guys, this is the end of the video and I'm waiting for your comments to let me know what to do. So well, as a, I plan, my plan is to burn them and you let me know why I shouldn't burn them or yes, it's a good idea. And we'll eventually probably end up burning them out here, <laughs> but we'll see how it goes. I just want a bit of bit of subscriber interaction with me and just let me know what you think I should do. And have you done this before or have you not? And it'd be interesting to see because I've never burnt this amount of uh, filter paper before to see will it have built, let it build up and um, just to see how it'll turn out. And again, we'll have our stannous tests and stuff like that on it. And we'll see, did we get the material at the end of it? So guys, give a thumbs up. Uh, give a comment, especially now on this video. I need to get some interaction back on you. And um, hopefully it will work. Um, now, again, usually when I record on this phone, there might be issues with sound for some reasons. If someone isn't using stereo or is using stereo, it's one of the two. It kind of plays up. I don't know is it if you're not using stereo or if you are using stereo. The sound may not come out 100% for you. But let me know, guys, in the comments below. Thumbs up. Till the next one, keep safe and keep on looking for that gold.